here with Donlene Gardner. Hi. No, I have to say congratulations on the cover Thank of this you. phenomenal magazine Thank with you. these incredible women as well. Thank you. Thank you. Now you are, of course, are no stranger to working with phenomenal women. Ava DuVernay. <laughs> Oprah, tell us about Queen Sugar now going into its fifth season, but what has been this process been for you like from the very beginning to now half a decade later? It's it's really changed me, I think. There's no other way to put it. It's It's been phenomenal. It's, I think, um, a singular experience to have such a close seat to two women who have such ownership of themselves, of what they're here for, of um, their their skill set, their beauty, their all of it. So it has um, it has really shifted me profoundly, fundamentally. Yeah. <laughs> And now you're inspiring other women through all of your incredible work too. Why was it important to you to, to share this cover with these incredible women and to tell your story? Well, I think, you know, it was a brilliant move of regards to actually have for women because there's something about community that is really important. And I think we've seen the last two to three years really um, with Me Too and Time's Up that um, it really is strength in numbers and it really is uh, us empowering each other that creates true change, lasting change, a real shift. So I am so proud. I'm just so proud to be a part of it. I'm proud to be on this cover. I'm proud of what Regard is doing in terms of recognizing all of that. Um, yeah, it's really an honor. Yeah, it's an honor to get to speak with you as well. Now, I also wanted to ask you because not only are you accomplished on camera, but lending your voice as well to some pretty big productions, uh, Star Wars. Uh, what is your process like approaching something on camera versus voiceover? And do you feel that working on projects like Star Wars and working with icons like Oprah is daunting in some ways or more inspiring for you? You know, it's funny because a Across everything that I do, I think one of my biggest sort of questions is why this, why now? That's really the approach, is why this, why now? And I think even in my writing life, I'm also a writer, it's it's really about what conversation are we having? Why this, why now? So I think that's that's really the drive. It, it runs through my acting work, it runs through my artwork, it runs through my advocacy work. Um, it's really the, the engine behind it all. Um, and then, you know, you can get into particulars and each medium sort of has its joy and its love. But I'm really answering that question. I'm really just seeking to, to answer that question. Well, thank you so much for talking with us. And congratulations on all of the success, too. Thank you very much. I appreciate that.